hi guys how are you today i have a thrift shop haul <laughs> they're not that popular in my channel it's the ones that get the least views but i love going thrift shopping and my husband does as well so here we go let's get started you guys all right let me show you i went to goodwill we often go to goodwill to see what they have and we found this nice little cigar box not thrilled about this <laughs> it's scary looking face but it's funny what it says <laughs> and then it's inside again but i figure it's nice to put stamps or whatever you want to put away you know and then i also this was in a jar sale i found this la gloria cubana the cigar box and it was full of, how do you call this? I forgot, I forget the name, but you know what these are. A whole bunch of this ones for $3, you guys. So, had to get it. And then, same jar sale. It was an old man, maybe a veteran, maybe. I don't know, but he was really nice. He gave me this one. I don't remember if it was a dollar or two dollars, but he gave me this little box for one or two dollars. Really nice as well. As you can see nice as well and then in that same jar cell he gave me this for a dollar it's wax it's a wax sealer like japanese wax sealer with japanese letters i believe for a dollar i couldn't pass on i couldn't pass it and then <laughs> this is an old-fashioned stamp like vintage stamp and i remember i went to this place let's try it you guys i remember i went to a vintage store and the stamps were much more than three dollars much more it was five ten dollars maybe this one was only two dollars and i was like you know what if i don't buy this stamp i'm gonna regret it so i got it these stamps are not like the new ones but we gotta give them a try because this is eh, nope <laughs> i'm thinking are they really stamps what are these things they look like stamps let's do it again but with this okay way better now huh this really does help huh look anyways i know i went to a, a antique store and in that antique store, I found more stamps. But before I show you the stamps, let me show you the bread. <laughs> I found more fake bread, but it looks so real, doesn't it? It was one fifty each, but I found more stamps. And these ones were three dollars each, and I had to get them because you don't find this often. Look, I believe they're stamps. What do you think these are? They look like stamps, wooden stamps, but they're not rubber. Maybe back in the day, they did not make them rubber because they didn't know they were the best way. They didn't know it was the best way to go, but let's try them, you guys. Vintage stamps. This is what these are. Definitely vintage stamps. Let's try some vintage stamps. Oh my goodness. I may not show you the rest of this haul if this video gets too long. Just trying out the stamps. How would they stamp these things like this? Oh my goodness, it doesn't look that good. Look at it. Not good at all, huh? Let's do the back of it. This were not the best stamps for sure. How do they do it before? I wonder. Do they, they didn't use this type of stuff. Do they use like real... I wonder how they did it before. All right, let's see. No, nope, they're not that great. Look, not that great. Not on my, not on my opinion. But let's try this last one. All right, let's try this last one. Which. Okay, this one looks better. 
But it, this one is the best one, I think. What do you guys think? All right. That's it with the stamps. Vintage stamps. Got to clean those up. But that's... All right. Now, this one I found in Northern Thrift. And this is the reason why I got it. Look, I was thinking for Dovers, maybe. Or anything, really. But mainly for that. See how it works out. $1.99. I don't know if I pay $1.99. I must pay $1.00. Maybe it was half off. All right. I show you this already. Now, this was from Goodwill. And this color was half off, so I paid a dollar for it. And look how nice it is. Look. Look, look, look. For a dollar. Right now. And then I found this beautiful, beautiful stickers for a dollar as well. Look at it. Isn't it nice? And nice love it and then i and uh, this was salvation army this was half off so i paid this is a big eraser and i paid 25 cents for this not bad now i love to put things inside this little boxes this little box was in a jar sale that we went with my husband and uh, it was free and <laughs> the guy gave it to me free and i always put stuff inside the boxes oh okay and then my husband bought me this one in a yard sale. So nice, right? And this one was a dollar. It's a little pin. Really nice, isn't it? Came in here. Really nice. And then I got some of this. This was a dollar. I think it's two of them. A big, long one. And a shorter one. For my jar sale, this big one. This is a big one. It reminds me of my grandma. <laughs> she used to like this type of stuff. Oh my goodness, it's dirty. I didn't notice it was dirty. Anyways, it's not for me. It's just to put it when I open a journal page. This one's very heavy though. This one's heavy. This one's even though there's uh, much more in this one. This one's not heavy. It's very very light. But this one's heavy. Might be better material. I don't know. Anyways, this little box was free. So, nice little free box, right? To put your stuff away. Really vintage looking. Very nice. And then, what else? What else? Oh, yes. We went to the Salvation Army. Was it Salvation Army? Today, this morning, to see what they had. My husband had to go to work a little later on. So, I found this one for 50 cents, a little stencil, nice, and then I found this keychain, I like it because it looks like it's a rose, and that's why I like it, and I think it was 50 cents, oh I forgot to show you, from the antique store, I got this, um, these postcards because they were 25 cents and this is where I live well I don't live in Providence anymore I used to live in Providence Federal Hill was a place where I used to go very often because I live very close to here but not anymore I live further from Providence but um, oh, this is so sentimental for me because it has the buildings I recognize some of these buildings really nice and then this one warwick lighthouse really nice see and then this place but i love the images too rhode island i still live in rhode island for those who don't know so 25 cents for each one of them okay and then this ones i found at the uh Sal salvation army for 40 or 50 because they were pink was half off so yeah 50 cents for this one couldn't pass them and then this one was 50 cents doilies i love me some doilies and then this ones were a bit expensive for my taste 199 because they weren't on sale and this was from the goodwill but i just love the different styles of doilies am i the only one this is like the junk journaling supplies maybe even and then you guys more doilies <laughs> i'm sure 
I paid a lot. One dollar for this one, and I don't even know how many it brings, but I just love. Maybe even one. Oh, my goodness. Let's see. I thought it was new until right now that I opened. I saw that it was open over here. It's supposed to have uh, nine. But nope, not nine. I think it only has two. Well, 50 cents each. But look how cute they are. I really like blue. Well, this one's sealed. So hopefully this one, it was 99 cents. This one's 99 cents too. And it says it has eight doilies. So hopefully it will have eight doilies. And then the very last thing I'm going to show you on this haul this thrift shop haul i still have a ton to show you guys but i can't overwhelm you with so much <laughs> is this wallpaper it was half off 199 so a dollar for this wallpaper let's open it up you guys all right this one was a dollar and i thought it was nice 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 oh okay like I told you before, this is like a big washi tape to me. Oh my goodness. Oh, it did not disappoint. Oh my. It says rosemary, lemon, lemon, thyme, oregano. I can't see. I can't read you that. Dill, oregano, rosemary, peppermint, lavender. Look at it. Isn't it nice? Oh my goodness. It's for a dollar, you guys. Not bad, huh? Junk journal supplies, huh? Oh, you know what? I have two more things over here. Two more things I forgot to show you. All right. This one was a dollar. I believe it was half off. Or maybe I did pay two dollars. I don't remember. But every time I find with blank pages, I love. And these pages are not that thin, you guys. So that's why I liked it. The pages are kind of thick. They might even be watercolor pages. It doesn't say, but $1.99. And then I found this one. I think it was a dollar. I'm not sure. But it looks pretty good quality. You know, put some get organized. And then you have this little pocket over here. Put the things inside. Not bad, huh? So this one's pretty, pretty good quality from Staples for $1.99. Not bad, huh? All right, that's it, you guys. All right, that's my haul. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it a lot. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Don't forget to let me know which one was your favorite item this time around. And please take care. God bless. Bye-bye.